All right, here we are. Oh, here it is. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> Gotta get rid of these enemies here first before we do anything. There's like a thief guy who will steal stuff from you, bump into you, and, you'll, and items will fly out of you. Towards where I got that heart piece, uh, way, way back in the beginning of the game. Steer clear of him. You'll find more of him later on. Alright, here we go. Classic Master Sword music, yes. Absolutely. Da, da. Whoa, there we go. We just throw our other sword. We just throw our other sword away. <laughs> Alright. What's up, Soft Sprawler? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know it. Awesome. Very good. I will. Alright, let's do this. Alright. Shit just got real, cause look, it's all clear now. And all the mists have lifted, what the hell? Oh no! That's not good at all! Oh yeah, see, yeah, that's the, uh, that's the guy I'm talking about. Can't kill him either. Really, really annoying. Get away from me! Ha! I'm faster than you, asshole. There we go. And now our attack power is level two. Yay! Oh, of course it led to a dead end. I think I can get apples here. I can get a uh, potion. Yeah, you can run into different trees and they'll give you certain different things. Or a bunch of bees will fly out. The best thing you can get is a whole bunch of apples. Because those are like uh, those are like hearts you can restore your life uh, by eating apples. In this game. Now don't forget, like, your attack power is two just with a sword swing. Not with a... Not with stabbing or with, uh... Yeah, there's some more thieves. Yeah, see? It steals your bombs and stuff like that. Whatever, but that wasn't that bad. If you run into somebody, your attack power is still... Oh! Never mind, I guess your attack power is, uh... Same if you run into somebody. Interesting. Maybe that's for later swords for like upgrades to this sword. I could be wrong, I don't know. Well, let's try and save uh, Zelda again. Run right into the door. Uh oh. No! Oh, that's no good. Alright, we'll get the hell out of here then. Let's go ahead and head to the castle. Yes, let's do it. Maybe take a little less. Oh, come on! It sucked. I wanted to get another heart so I could demonstrate what happens, but apparently. Can't do that, that's fine. There we go. Yeah, good stuff. It can deflect projectiles too. Like arrows and rocks and stuff. Yeah, good stuff there. Uh, yeah, the uh, beams have attack power of one, so keep that in mind. Go lift this out of the way. Boom. There we go. Alright, let's go ahead and climb up, uh, climb up this place now. There we go. Go down here. And through here. Alright. Yeah, and yeah, you were able to go here before, but you can't, like, kill this thing without the Master Sword, so, yeah. Which is unfortunate. 
Yeah, you want to have the beams for these guys because these guys can do a lot of damage too and they can take a lot of them too. Not really smart to attack them from close quarters. Although you can stun them with the boomerang, they'll like shake it off like almost immediately. Nice. Ooh, we got a fairy, but I don't need it. This is also a very short dungeon. I don't need that, but thank you very much. Ah, need the lamp. There we go. There we go. Nice. Get a key, very good. Oh, I can't light that thing. Oh, well. I don't really need it anyways anymore since there's no more enemies. Might want it for the next room, but I think I'll be alright either way. Yeah, I'll be fine. Just these two clowns. Easy enough. Easy enough to beat. Okay, we got more darkness here. Wow, that was uh, interesting. Because my sword was, because my shield was pointed in the way of the arrow when I was swinging my sword, it it uh it deflected it. <laughs> That's pretty funny. There we go. Need that too. I forget what this does. Oh, it just opens the uh, door to go back if you need to go back. I don't know why you want that, but whatever. Oh, you jerk. Yeah, he's just gonna be firing arrows at me. Nice. And we're good. Alright. We don't need the uh, lamp anymore, apparently. guys have a little bit more hit points than most. Yeah, that's right though. Ah, okay. Yeah, that becomes a theme in Zelda also where apparently you have dragoons in this game. <laughs> where yeah you have to like play tennis with the uh, main bad guy. And it starts in the, it started in this game. I still take a lot of hits. There we go. Nice. Maybe, I get, maybe we can get some hearts here. Nice. What else we got? Come on, give me some heart. There we go. Alright, we're good. I was gonna bypass all of you. Sorry. <laughs> That's funny. It's like, yeah, I don't really care about any of you. I don't care about you guys either. Yeah, don't cross this without killing that guy. I made the mistake of trying to do that, and it never works out. <laughs> Alright, here we are. The final boss of the game. No, not really. Of course there's more to it. Come on now. Uh-oh, there's Zelda right there. No good. No! Stop him. Oh, well, you can't, because you can't inflict per uh, physical damage to Agony. Get away from the fire at us. It's not going to do that when he has Zelda captive. No! What? Man. Ah, where'd you go? Yeah, well, pretty simple where he went. On curtain. There's something cool you can do. Check this out. You'll see what I'm meaning here. Ha! Huh. You can use... Bug catching that to reflect his magic. That was not a good example. There we go. <laughs> and you can actually—it's actually a better weapon because you won't be—you won't—you can get close to him and not like worry about 
the uh, fireball not deflecting. Yeah, when he does this, he's got to fire lightning. Stay away from that. It does a lot, which does a ton of damage. Ha <laughs> ha I don't know why they have the bug catching that do that, but it's awesome. Come on, stop firing those blue fireballs that don't hurt you, troll. Oh my god, really? And he's gonna do the lightning again. It's pretty cool lightning, man. <laughs> Oh, wait, oh, okay. I was gonna say, come on. Do lightning twice. It's not right. Come on. Ah! Jerk. There we go. It's an easy boss, man. And let me guess lightning. Hit you with my net. <laughs> Nice. Alright, come on. Come on, man. Ah! There we go. Uh oh. Oh no! He's not dead yet. He drew us into the dark world. Ah! The dark world, so it used to be. This is, uh, I guess, like the uh, see it. Man, how does that work? Like, is there like two dimensions or something? Or, like, I don't understand this. Like, it's so, like, which one's the real world? Is this the real world? And the light world's just like the illusion, the other dimension? Like, they don't explain this well, and uh, they never do in any game, uh, except maybe Chrono Cross. But even in Chrono Cross, it's like. It, you need to have, be, have like some kind of like physics degree. You need to be like, you need to be like, uh, what's the guy who wrote a brief history of time? Uh, ah, I forget his name. I forget his name. This guy like talks via machine because he has some kind of uh, condition. Wow, I cannot believe that I don't know this guy. Anyways, we get another piece, a uh, heart piece there. Yay. These enemies do a lot of damage, so be e careful. And you want at least a hundred and I think fifty rupees for this next uh, for the next uh, dungeon. So yeah. I'm good with what I have right now. Actually, you know what? I can get some. Uh, well, no, I don't think I can get anything right now. I can get that other spell uh, at the uh, right next to the Tower of Harrow, but I'm not going to do that. Now. I'll do that later, I'm just, I'm just gonna go right to the next uh, dungeon. So much dungeon crawling in this game is amazing. Yeah, these guys take a lot of hits to beat him. Yeah. These guys still take, like, nothing. Moblins, yep. I'm thinking maybe, like, this is the, uh, the actual world and the light world is the other dimension. Uh, I could be wrong on that. Would someone please explain that to me? Because I don't know what the hell it is. I'm not going in that. Area. I don't need to go there. All I know is that that guy does a lot of damage. Stay clear. Or kill him or something. You know what I mean. I'm right, going right way now. And let's go ahead and do this. Very good. Take him down. That was easy. I go through here, I think. Ah, oh, God, I hate this, I hate this part. It's like, really, like, how, why do you have to have one? What the hell? Yeah, so you gotta pay this guy. If you don't pay this guy, then he just leaves you, and you need him to open the uh, door to the next dungeon, so. But you should have, I mean, like, at, but by this time of the game, you, you have way more access to money than you could ever hope to imagine, so. Alright. There you go. Shut up and take my money. Sorry, I've been watching awesome games done quick of uh, this year. It's pretty amazing. Alright, I'm gonna just follow this up in the next video.